What's up YouTube? Trippy Mail here with you guys. I'm here with Kate Liana. So, I've had so many people ask me, Mel, can you walk me through a video to show me how you actually done the whole grommet cutting and all that? So we're going to go step by step and we're going to walk you through it from the tape all the way to the very end. So y'all hang with us and let's get started. Alright guys, so as my wife told us last time, we're going to use, I call it uh, masking tape. Some people just call it painting tape. I don't know what you call it, whatever the real word is. But my wife says we're going to put about two or three layers. And actually, before we do that, we're actually going to take, and uh, this time we're going to do them about one inch. And I'm doing this so I can drop maybe like two or three cables in it. So they're going to be, uh, I'm going to put them like right here uh, on the desk. And I'm going to do it so I can drop these cables right here coming from my monitor. So that way I don't, I don't want any cables hanging off the back of my desk. I'm working on cable management as you see here. We're going to drop these down in here, but we're not going to do it during this video. We're going to do it just kind of later on on our time. But I want to walk you through this one and I may do one right here. Just depends on how long it takes. This wood, does it looks generic, but this wood is not generic as you see as we'll get started. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and get started here with the tape. But the first thing you need to do, guys, is uh, get you a marker. I got the little heart marker, so this is made for, like, carpenter um, junk, you know, whatever, like, carpenters do. They just mark stuff. So I've went in here. I actually have two markings. I'm going to do another one over there later. I just don't really have my mind set to what I'm doing. So I've went in, and I've put a little dot right here. All right, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and make it a little bit bigger, guys. That way that I can see it through my tape. And, um... I'm going to make the tape, like I said, about two or three layers, uh, so it doesn't really have to be that big. This tape will actually just tear, so you really don't have to have any scissors for it. So, and uh, what you want to do is you want to put a piece kind of like that. You don't really got to tape it all the way down very good, just because uh, I'm tearing it a little bit too big. But I'm doing that so I'm able to see it. And uh, you want to keep uh, drawing your little dot on top, unless you can keep up with where you're putting your dot. And uh, that I'm not good at. So I'm just going to keep drawing it over the top of my tape. That way I know the little area that I'm putting it in. So we're just going to go two or three layers deep. And guys, trying to cut through the tape and trying to cut through uh, the wood is very, very tough. This is not an easy project. Uh, so I would say like if you're underage or you're some kids and you're wanting this done, I would definitely get your parents to help. So this is like... Probably not a good thing that you would want to just bust out doing on your own. We also put a trash bag down to catch the trash. That is true. So, we done the whole trash thing so we don't make a mess. Yeah, I don't think you should go any more than that. Alright guys, that's about it. She says, let's not go anymore. Alright, so, as you see, I didn't tape it all the way down. It doesn't have to be. All right, so guys, you're going to need to go to like a Lowe's, Home Depot, wherever, whatever store you guys have. Uh, I know some of you all are in different countries, and I'm not really sure. I do know that if you're, I think if you're in the UK or it's over in Australia, y'all, I think it's Australia, y'all have a store called Asda. Asda's owned by Walmart. So when I say we go to Walmart, y'all go to Asda. And I figured this out from Eager Beck. So thanks, Eager Beck, for telling me last night. <laughs> so y'all go to Asda if you're in another country, and y'all buy this so this is just it's made by craftsman and uh actually what it's called is a hole saw that's kind of funny in it like a hole saw anyway so they're going to unscrew you got to be careful you'll notice that it'll probably uh like uh, loosen up during my whole little trip here but uh this uh thing here let's let me show y'all this is a ultra steel and i'm going to clown on my wife this was the cheapest junkiest thing she probably could have bought me this come from uh, Fred's before they went out of business. And if you have no idea what that is, just another generic store that sells clothes, tools, food, whatever. Anyway. But right. in my defense, I never actually thought we would need it. So. Oh, so she bought it because she didn't think we would need it. You know what I'm saying? So, of course, leave it to her. Let me tilt the camera straight because she doesn't know how. All right, guys. All right, and I went on Amazon. And actually, you can buy these for like 3 or $4 a piece. Or you can buy like a whole pack. We got 10 for like what, six, $7, eight bucks? Yeah, yeah anywhere serious. between six and like nine bucks, I got 10. So why not get 10 instead of paying four or five dollars a piece for one? All right, so these here, uh, I don't know if my wife said, oh, they do, never mind. All right, these come apart. Some of them do not, guys, and you can get them in silicone. So we're going to keep it apart for the moment. This is made for you to be able to stick your cables in it. And, uh, 
You can just snap that down in there when you adjust your cables and you're good to go. All right, so we're going to get started here and uh, hey, y'all hope the best. All right, guys, let's see what we got. I'm not sure where my wife wants to stand. Anywhere she can kind of fit yeah, in, she I'm may not need sure to. Either. All right, here we go, guys. Pray for me. Well, that didn't work. Okay, hang on. Your hand was blocked. Oh, uh, my bad. All right, well, I've got to press down on it, guys. She's going to try to get the best angle. And as you see, it's going to stop, guys. Or it is on my drill. Why? Because the wood is so freaking hard. This gets hot, guys. So y'all be careful. I'm going to grab the vacuum. All right. And then you want to go over here. Yeah, she's going to grab the vacuum. She'll walk you through that while I'm getting this back on. Grab your vacuum cleaner. Just grab the little end of it. Whenever she gets done, I'll go over there and suck it up. All right, I'll hold this while she's doing that, guys. If the camera's a little shaky and a little off, we apologize. It does make kind of a big mess here, guys, so you want to keep a vacuum really close by. It's going to take us a few minutes. Y'all bear with us. And if y'all just want to wait to the end and see the finished product, you know, of what's happened, you're more than welcome just to go ahead and uh, just kind of, what is the button? Uh, fast forward. So, guys, y'all can go ahead and fast forward on through the video if you want. Uh, you'll get the end result. All right, we're going to go back here. My wife's going to come around. Come. All right, so that way she can uh, get in the distance here. Let me get back down in the hole here. So it will take a little bit, guys. Something in what? Right there. See? It's sticking it's the tape in there. It's stuck in the thing. Oh. Yeah. All right. I was confused on what she meant, guys. You'll have to take it off. The tape is it. stuck down in here. I got her now. I didn't know what she meant. So, yeah, guys, this is really the hard part. We didn't think we were going to get it last time. We thought that it was just going to be this way, and that's how it was going to be. But as you see, that wood is very tough, guys. Like, very, very tough. All right, guys, so we're going to screw this back on. Then it takes a lot, guys. It actually looks like metal. No, it's wood. Okay. Yeah, it's not metal. All right, guys, here we go again. Let's go give it a shot. Uh, we're going the wrong way. go guys and it stinks really bad when you do this all right guys all right, time to suck it up all right guys Ooh, god it smells horrible so just be prepared for this burning nasty smell it smells like i'll be honest it smells like dog shit guys you can pull the tape off if you want baby okay. all right guys let y'all see the beautiful wife here She's doing a fabulous job. Don't judge me. I'm at home in my pajamas. I didn't. That's what the whole All right, guys. That's what it looks like. Did the bottom come off? Yeah. We busted the bottom of the desk a little bit, but I guess that's part of it sometimes, guys. I'll get all the rest of it later. Majority of and here's the mess in the floor. Not that bad. I'll vacuum the rest of that up. I is there anything in that? Let me show them that. All right, guys. And as you see, the wood piece is stuck in the bottom of this. So I think the when I busted my desk was because I was pushing a little bit too hard. So, uh, but let's let's go under and look at it. Let's see what kind of damage we did. Ah, that's heartbreaking, guys. Is it bad? Ah, we did it, guys. We absolutely did it, didn't we? All right, guys. It's going to be all right. I will fix it. I will get that piece uh, fixed over top. But I can't be mad at anyone but myself, guys. All right. So let's see here. And it doesn't even go down in there. No. 
No. It wants to, but uh, this little piece here needs to be. All right, I got an idea, guys. All right, bring me the drill. Yeah, hang on. I have to dump this out. All right, guys, let her get this wood piece out of it here. So I'll let y'all see what she's doing. She's going to get that out of there. Guys, if you have any comments or anything that you want to drop below, any questions, concerns, just go ahead and drop it below and uh, would be glad to hear from you. I probably should have put some tape on the bottom side too and it probably wouldn't have cracked my desk. Here, it just, yeah, I keep pushing through the bottom top. It's just because it's hard. She can't hardly get the wood piece out, guys. And guys, uh, we're not using a phone here. We are actually using uh, my YouTube uh, camera stabilizer and big light. That way y'all are able to see. Would you like me to work on it? No, I'm almost there now. All right. She thinks she's almost got it, guys. Oh, there it is, guys. Look how thick it is. I want you to show them how thick the wood is. Come a little closer to it. Guys, look how thick the wood is. Like, that is unbelievable. All right, awesome. All right, so let me do get to work here and try something. Hey, I don't need that on there. No? No, no, no. Okay. I don't need this part. Not at all. All right, guys. So I'm going to let her hold this. Hey, don't just jerk it. Okay. I'm all set. All right, guys. We're just going to thin it out. Because it's catching at the bottom. So we're just going to kind of like saw it. So this is what you can do if it goes in there and you can't get it to flatten out. You could also probably take the other drill and come up from the bottom. Yeah, you could probably come through the bottom, but uh, there really wasn't that much I needed to do. Yeah, so let me see. Just certain parts I think of the desk is catching it. We're going to get it in there, guys. Alright, let's see what we got. Bam! Alright, guys. So, there's the finished product. Where's the little lid that goes in it? Alright, All right, guys. And we're not going to run the wires through it at the moment. Because I'm going to actually see if I can't work on the bottom of the desk here to see what I can get going. Um, so, yeah, there's some type of tape product they've put on this. So that's why it looks like that. All right. So let's snap that back in there. And there it is, guys. Right there. You have it. We're going to drop the cables down in there. As uh, soon as we're done, so which would be these cables, it's going to be three cables that we're going to drop down in there. And uh, because with it being that small, we won't have a lot of room for it. So uh, it worked out really, really well other than the bottom here. But hey, it's expected. Uh, we didn't lose much on the bottom. It was just a little bit. And like I said, I think it was because it didn't cut through. I was pushing it and I caused it to bust out. You know what I'm saying? With that being plastic, the little teeth wasn't cutting it. So... Uh, yeah, but uh, that's it. Other than that, guys, I greatly appreciate you being here. If you liked the video, be sure to subscribe to the channel. It's free. Be sure to hit the bell for the notifications. And uh, make sure that you drop all your comments, your questions, concerns, anything. If you want to know about any information we've used again, uh, just leave me a, a question or whatever uh, in the description comments below. And I will be happy to answer you back, letting you know anything. And uh, guys, I will update you on what I've done to the bottom of the desk to get it fixed. But I promise you, let this mind work. We'll get it fixed and we'll get it worked worked out other than that guys uh don't forget to follow me on twitch mixer of course right here on youtube and over on facebook under trippy mail mail be sure to follow my wife under kate liana over on facebook twitch and of course over on mixer all the names are the same guys we greatly appreciate you being here please smash a thumbs up if you liked it or go ahead and drop a thumbs down if you didn't either way i want to hear your opinion other than that y'all have a great day be kind to one another and i'll catch you in the next video see ya